Our next speaker is Professor Cheng Ming Bai from China. Parity duality of super R matrices via O operators and pre least super algebras. So please start uh, your can discussion. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, thank you. Uh, the screen is okay? Yes, yes, it's okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. at first, uh, I thank the organizers to invite me to give a, a talk here. So I think it is a very good uh, opportunity to, to organize such a now associative uh, uh, day. It's quite good. So it's also my pleasure to meet uh, all of you online. Uh, maybe more, uh, you know the, the situation in China is not very good now, but uh, I think the situation is better, uh, will be better and better. So I hope next time uh, we will meet uh, on site, face to face, not uh, like this time online. Oh, anyway, thank you very much. And also, uh, I welcome all of you to visit China uh, to to meet in China. Okay, so uh, today I will give a talk uh, on the uh, on the study of a special kind of the duality between old and even uh, super R matrix through the uh, the theory of the O operators and the pretty super algebras. This talk, this work is uh, 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 joint work with the Professor Yi Guo. Uh, from the Rutgers University in uh, at New York in the United States, and the Rinfen Zhang from East Normal uh, East West Normal University in China. Uh, Li Guo will give a talk today uh, later. So the talk I will uh, divide into four parts. In the first part, I will introduce the main ideas. Uh, how to study the, the super uh, R matrix uh, in terms of the, uh, the, the so-called parity uh, uh, duality. Uh, uh, it's the our uh, introduced the uh, introduction of the main approach. In the second part, I will uh, give the relationships between the super R matrix and the orbiters. By these relationships, we give the Parity duality, and then it is the the, the our main theorem about oh, the oh, parity oh, duality. Oh. Uh, about the parity duality of orbitals and the super R matrix. Finally, we use the uh, the so called pre least super algebras to uh, uh, to give the construction of the the different uh, orbiters and uh, uh, show the implicit relationships between the orbiter and the super R matrix and uh, uh, give the, uh, the, the, the uh, identity about the, the parity duality uh, between the even and all the super R matrix. Okay, so firstly, I will recall what is the super R matrix? Super R matrix is uh, related to the, the super classical Young Bach equation. So it's defend, uh, defined on the least super algebra. Least super algebra on the R is uh, uh, element in the uh, two, two tensors in, in, that is in the G tensor G. G is the uh, least super algebra. And they satisfy this uh, equation. Uh, it makes sense in the U looping Universal European algebra. So this the uh, the tensor form uh, with the for the equation. Later I will use uh, use the, some other forms to uh, explain what it does mean. Okay, then uh, we call a solution of the super R uh, super Yama equation called is a super R matrix. That means uh, usually in, our, in 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 this talk. We assume G, uh, the least super algebras and uh, all the weak space and the super weak space is the 
finite dimensional. So uh, why it's called the R matrix? That means give an element uh, in a tensor in a uh, in a G tensor G, uh, we can we can uh, fix the basis of G, and this uh, basis the R can uh, can be written uh, in the form is I G E I tensor E G. The I G uh, construct and this basis construct a, a matrix. So this in this things is called the super R matrix. For the ordinary Lie algebra. This also makes sense in the ordinary Lie algebra. So it's the super R matrix. Uh, it's the R matrix, and uh, in the least super algebra case, uh, it's the the super matrix. So it's called the super R matrix. Okay. So uh, we we gave the definition of the class Yamaha equation. So uh, 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 just now I also introduced the uh, it's a, a tensor. Usually. The tensor form is not easy to handle. So sometimes uh, uh, it's very natural to ask uh, for a fixed base uh, is, uh, uh, is the, uh, the solution corresponding to a, 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 a super matrix or matrix. So it's natural to ask that for the any super matrix, it's also uh, corresponding to a leader map. So uh, for a leader map, uh, it's natural to ask uh, for such a linear map, what condition should be certified such, such that it, it's uh, corresponding to the uh, super class? Does this R need to be even or out? Uh, this uh, here, this homogeneous, uh, not matter even or out. In fact, we, we will uh, study the even and odd. Here, the, uh, the element should be homogeneous, that's all. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay. so uh, we we show that means we should interpretation the equal uh, the equation one uh, in terms of the optic forms. This so called the optic forms. So uh, we first uh, recall the study in the ordinary case. So we used uh, the some the optic forms to characterize the 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 classical Yama equation. Okay. So in the ordinary case, is uh, we, we define the so-called orator. The orator means give a Lie algebra and the representation. Uh, rho is a representation from uh, G to GRV. And uh, a linear map is from the uh, representation space to the Lie algebra itself, uh, satisfy this condition. Uh, this notion was given by the Kupschmidt in the study of the class of Yamaha equation in the ordinary case. Uh, in fact, many uh, persons uh, don't like this, person, uh, this uh, notion because the operator uh, in the Kupschmidt's work means the operator operator. The O is the operator means. Uh, so in some things, operator operator doesn't make sense. So they also call the a uh, relative road buster or the something else. But I think uh, it's uh, given by the Christian at first. So we give the credit to him. So we still call it the orbiter. Okay. So there are there is a very close relationship between the orbiters and the class Yamaha equation. First, uh, from the one side is from the class Yamaha equation to orbiter is given by Kubishmid. So that means uh, for any skew symmetry solution, so given the algebra R is the skew symmetry, then R is a solution of the class Yamaha equation. If and only if uh, R can be regarded as the uh, uh, linear map from the uh, G star, the dual space of G to G is the orbiter associated to the core drawn representation, AD star. AD star is the uh, dual representation of the or drawn representation. Here we can see the, the reason is very simple because in the finite dimensional, the the, the G tensor G, this big space, the, 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 the tensor space is uh, linear isomorphic to the home from home G star to G, the all the linear maps from the G star to G. So that's the, the is the uh, linear uh, isomorphism 
So for any R in in the in the tensor space G tensor G is corresponding to a mic from G star G. So in this case, R satisfies the Clausian equation when R is good symmetry. The good symmetry the, the condition is necessary. And then the G star G, this linear map satisfies the this equation. So this called the uh, in some things it's just the orbital sorry to the eight star. So this one side from the screw symmetry solution of the TYBE to orbiter. Conversely, so it's very natural to ask the whether we can, uh, from the orbiters, we can get a solution of the TYBE. So if so, we can unify the TYBE in the tensor form with the orbiters. So the, uh, the answer is, uh, uh, is yes. Uh, but uh, it's not from the, the, the orbiter to the CYB. The solution of CYB is not uh, uh, the Lie algebra itself, but uh, in a bigger Lie algebra. So we use the notation, the, the semi direct uh, sum of a Lie algebra and uh, its uh, representation. So give a Lie algebra and uh, a representation rho. So on the big space, G plus V we have a, a natural Lie algebra structure by this one, it's some direct sum. Okay, or oh, some direct uh, product, okay. Anyway, so uh, our main result is given by Gewa Lie algebra. So we can get, get a, a representation. Then for any uh, uh, operator from the V to G, we can invite uh, to element so it's an element as the G tensor V star. So we can uh, put it into the uh, G plus V star tensor G plus V star. So we can use the symmetry sum with the G rho star V star is the Lie algebra with the, uh, by the V star uh, through the representation rho star. So it's a big Lie algebra. So then we can use the skills, uh, skills, uh, or of T, T uh, minus sigma t. Since sigma is the uh, exchange the 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 the, the sigma uh, action on the v tensor v means the sigma x y equals to y sigma. It's flip uh, uh, operator. Then the t minus sigma t is a single symmetry solution in the big Lie algebra. If and only if it's the O operator. So in this uh, result, we can know from the operator we can get a solution, skill symmetry solution of class Yamai equation. So in this sense, the operator and the class Yamai equation um, is unified. So we can, from one side, we can from skill symmetry solution of CYBE to operator, conversely from the uh, operator to CYBE. So you know, the main, uh, main problem in the study of the CYBE is to find solutions. So just in order to finish this job, we need to get uh, the examples of solution uh, of the orbiters, okay? So in order to get orbiters, we introduced another algebra structures, namely the pretty algebra. So of course, pretty algebra is not only related to the CYBE, in fact, uh, they, uh, they appear in many uh, uh, topics. Uh, in, the, in the morning, the first talk is going by the uh, uh, Dr. Zhang, he mentioned uh, the not, uh, not, not compatible. Not compatible is a special class of the pre algebra. It's also another name, it's left symmetry algebra. Uh, it appears in the study of the uh, of fine structures and the groups and some other fields. Anyway, a pretty algebra is with space with such uh, uh, identity. This identity, uh, the left part uh, is just uh, the ordinary, uh, the, 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 the ordinary of the associator. The pretty means the algebra is also another name is the left symmetry algebra means the associator is uh, uh, left is symmetric in the uh, x, y, the, the, the left two variable. So it is a oscillator x, y, z equals to y, x, z. Okay. Okay. 
pretty algebra have the two fundamental properties. One fundamental one property is the commutator of the pretty is the algebra. So it's a kind of uh, the, 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 the algebra structure whose commutator is the algebra called the real admissible algebra. So pretty is a special kind of the real admissible algebra. But it's not the whole real admissible. In some things, it's a special real admissible. So they have the, another special property. It's the second property. That means this property is more important. That means uh, the left multiplication operators of pretty gave a representation of the commutator the algebra. So this is very important. Okay. So by this proportion, the, the, the two properties, we can, we can see in some things the pretty algebra is the algebra structures between the operators and the pre, and the, the class MI equation. So this, this means give up operator on the representation space we can define a pretty structure. It's very uh, simple. Give an orbiter on the representation space, we can get a pretty. Conversely, for any pretty, and uh, we can construct an orbiter of the commutator the algebra. So that means. They were pretty because the left, uh, left multiplication operators give a uh, remutation of the commutator algebra. This is also called the sub adjacent. Okay. Then the identity, the identity very simple, is the operator also related to the remutation. So this is the remutation between uh, uh, pretty and the operator. Okay. By this equation, by this, uh, the operator and the CYBE and the combined the operator and the pretty, we can get the relationship between the CYBE. So that means from any pretty, because identity is the operator. So and uh, any operator can give a solution of a CYBE in a big, in the big the algebra. So we can get uh, from any pretty, we can get uh, uh, such R in the uh, such R in such form is a solution of the class M equation in this the algebra. So that means any pretty gives the solution of a uh, class M equation. So that means the any pretty gave a, a super R matrix uh, with such form. In this sense, the EI is a, a basis of the uh, pretty algebra and the uh, yeah, star is the dual basis. So, so it's nature to conserve this. Uh, this study is uh, available for the ordinary D algebra. So we should uh, conserve whether it's uh, can generalize to the supercase. In fact, the supercase the generation in the even. It's a quite a straightforward. In some cases, it's a totally parallel. So the even solution means the R super R matrix, R equals to SI tensor YI, the tensor factors SI and YI for a given I have the same parity. That means XI and YI, all of them are even, all of them are old. In this sense, the generation is quite simple. It's uh, almost the, the direct, uh, straightforward, and parallel to the ordinary case. So it finished uh, about uh, uh, 12 years ago. So it's also can uh, we, we should uh, uh, consider whether it can it's ten, uh, generate, uh, generalize to the old case. So that means the old solution of the super. Uh, uh, CYBE. In this sense, the R equals to SI tensor YI, uh, the SI and the YI uh, have the opposite the parity, it means the SI is even and the YI is old, or SI is old and Y is even. In this sense, so uh, 
in some sense, the old old solution of the super arm uh, Yamba equation is uh, uh, there are very few studies. So it's also not to know how the orbiters can give uh, the old super arm matrix. So this uh, uh, ch challenger uh, in some sense is not like the uh, the even case. So generation should be careful. And uh, the, uh, it seems there are also some the uh, some big problem. You know, just now I introduced in the other case the pre D is uh, uh, can give the very natural examples of the orbiters and then the solutions of a class M equation. And uh, we also in this sense. The pretty gave the orbiter its identity. So in the even case, the identity is over, obviously a even map. So in the even case, so it's probably no, no problem. But through so the old case, so in uh, uh, from this uh, from the, uh, this issue, we can see identity obviously cannot work here. It cannot be an old orbiter. So there will be some of the big problem. That means the pretty surprise worlds, it seems couldn't give examples of the old orbiters. So the natural question is whether and how to get an old orbiter naturally from a pretty surprise world. You know, for the pretty surprise world, it's just like the edge world. They are not old and even. There are only one de definition. And the, but the solution, orbiter, orbiter they have old and even, and the solution have old and even. So it seems they, it's a big problem. So in this talk, I will introduce how to uh, deal with these problems. We use the uh, a unified treatment uh, uh, gave the. Uh, relationships, the treatment of the relationship between the even and the old super uh, R matrix and the orbiters. Then the, this the unified treatment, so we, uh, we can uh, not uh, not matter is even and old. We can get the uh, uh, the, the the relationship between old and even. And how to deal with the second problem? Uh, how to from the pretty super adverse to give the, uh, the, 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 the old, in the old case, uh, to, to give the old uh, uh, orbiter. So uh, we find uh, there uh, is a very important property of the, uh, the, the super adverse representation. It has, a, this means it's a parity reversion. So parity reversion is given any representation of uh, uh, the uh, of uh, uh, the spread world. Uh, it's uh, there is a natural uh, representation uh, with the parity reversed. We use the, this kind of the property. We construct a duality between even and old orbiters, and by this you. Uh, the duality, we can give parity duality of super R matrix. And uh, in particular, a uh, pretty surprise world naturally defines an even orbiter. And uh, by the duality, we can get an uh, old orbiter. So this thereby giving rise to a parity pair of super R matrix. So that means, of course, a pretty super adverse, only the identity give an even orbiter, but that's uh, only the one side of the story. In fact, they have the hidden side is the identity we have, we can construct uh, 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 by the duality, an old orbiter from the identity. And then the identity, the old uh, the, uh, uh, operator can give the uh, old super 
R matrix. So that means from the same the pretty superpowers, we can get a, a pair of super R matrix, the old, even and old. So this all was the main approach. So we uh, generalizing the, 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 the study in the ordinary case. In this uh, our study, the K uh, K row is the parity relation of the least surprise implementations. Okay, so next uh, we give the the details about uh, uh, this theory. So first we give the unified uh, treatment between the super R matrix and the operators. In this study, no matter the uh, super R matrix and operator. Uh, even and old, we use the the, uh, the same uh, the, the same treatment. Okay, so the representation of the least surprise bro is uh, is well known by by this one. Okay, so we define the the so called the, the orbiter. So give a least surprise bro and the uh, uh, representation is also uh, a homogeneous linear map from the uh, represent space to the uh, supervised reserve called the orbiter. So that's why this condition. This condition is just the, uh, the ordinary orbiter with the uh, graded uh, the graded form. So we can see the TVTW equals to the right hand side with some the uh, degree. Okay, so in this sense, or reason is called the even or the old if it's uh, the even or the old little map. We use the, the O0 or the O1 to denote the size of the even and the old orbiters. Okay. We also give some notation. First, for we 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 we, 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 we know we have the 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 linear map uh, uh, v tensor v uh, equals to uh, isomorphic to the home from home we start to V, the linear maps from we start to V. And in this sense, uh, by this, the nature uh, in a isomorphism, we can get for any uh, tensor, uh, tensor element, here we use the, the super sub, uh, uh, subspace element, the V tensor V corresponding to a TR, a linear map, from we start to be by this one. Here we can see the the uh, the R is even on the old. Uh, uh, if I know if the all x uh, uh, the S I and the Y I have the same or the positive parity, and we also find uh, for the linear map we have the degree. So in this sense, we can find uh, the R and the T R have the same the parity. Is the uh, basic knowledge in the linear algebra, okay? And uh, next uh, is uh, very important. We give the twist uh, map. Twist map. We also have some the uh, the degree by the sigma. The sigma uh, the, 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 the the twist map can define uh, what 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 is called the super symmetry or the skewed super symmetry. The supersymmetry is called is means the sigma r equal to r, and the skew supersymmetry means the sigma r to uh, equal to minus r. Okay, in, in some sense, uh, here we know for the r we have all the the parity is even and old, and for the uh, the r in the v tens in the g tensor g we also have the symmetry uh, symmetry supersymmetry. So Usually, we need to find some important case about uh, the old plus supersymmetry. And in the even case, we usually we, we, we conserve skewed supersymmetry. It's very important. Usually, just like the only case, only case, the solution is skewed symmetry. And in the, in the super case, is the even plus skew supersymmetry. And in the old case, usually we consider the supersymmetry. So for this case, we call the, the pan supersymmetry for both cases. So the pan supersymmetry we unify the means there are two cases, 
either old plus supersymmetry or even plus skew supersymmetry. And the point supersymmetry is uh, characterized by the sigma r equals to minus minus one, the degree r, r. Okay, so we can define the S0 or S1, the site of the even and old super R matrix. Okay, so then we can define the dual representation is always uh, the standard the, 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 the definition in the study of the representations of the these super algebras. So this is called a dual representation. Then we can get uh, the, our main result, or the first uh, the main result, so give a Lee surprise bro and R is uh, in the G tends to G is a pun super symmetry. We emphasize again here means the even plus the secure uh, super symmetry uh, and the old plus uh, uh, super symmetry. Then we can see R is a uh, uh, a solution of the 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 the, 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 the Ivan solution or the old solution of the uh, uh Ivan or old school school matrix if and only if the component T R is a uh, uh Ivan or the old uh operator of sorry to the core round representation. Okay, we also can define the Representation of uh, the, the 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 super algebra and the, the summer director uh, the the semi director uh, product of a uh, uh, Lie algebra uh, Lie super algebra and the representation so by this one so semi director product. Okay, then we give the this the uh, uh, this theorem is only one side from the. In something is from the uh, super R matrix to the orbiter. So the next uh, we, we we considered how to generalize the from the orbiter to the super R matrix. So we use the, the semi direct product. So uh, give a uh, uh, M n dimensional uh, vector super uh, space. V i is a homogeneous basis, and V i star is the dual basis. So for the uh, linear map, the, the space of the linear map from the V to G uh, is isomorphic to G tensor V star. So we can find an element from G to V is identified with the T, uh, the two, two tensor by one. In this sense, we can see the degree of T, the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the small T is uh, equals to the capital T. So we can define the RT is the, in some things, the, the, the skill, uh, the, the skill symmetry, uh, 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 the skill symmetry are in some things of the, 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 the small T by this one. In this things, so that means from the INA linear map T, we can get RT. RT is in the uh, tenth space. In the big, uh, in the big, big Lie uh, super Lie algebra, so the uh, tensor ten space, uh, it's easy to to define the R. Oh, sorry, R is the pan super symmetry. So our maybe, uh, another result is give a Lie super algebra and the T is a homogeneous linear map. Then the R T is a super R matrix in the uh, the semi director product is right row if and only if T is the orbiter. What we find here the, the, the orbiter is uh, the, this orbiter and the, the, the R have the same the parity. Okay. Then uh, combine the two results together. So one result is from the any uh, 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 super R matrix with some of the uh, find some uh, super symmetry. Uh, we can get a uh, operator. Conversely, from an operator, we can get a uh, 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 we can get a super R matrix in the tensor uh, in the big Lie uh, algebra. So, combined together, we can get the uh, three uh, equivalent condition. 
when t is a orbiter with the degree with the parity even and or uh, and odd and rt by this one by, by this one rt has the same the parity is a uh, uh, super matrix in the uh, big the uh, and uh, from the rt we also because this the pencil we have we have say that it's R is the RT is the pan supersymmetry. So by the first results, we also can from RT we can the TRT. But by this one, by by by, by the this equation, the TRT is also oh is in the uh, the big uh, this vector with the core drum orientation is an orbiter associated with the core drum orientation. We, we find both the TRT and the TRT has the same the parity. It's very important. In, so in these things, we can see in some things, uh, the results in the even case is parallel to the old case. So that means the uh, the results uh, of, of of course we we uh, we have proved that the the results is hold in the even case and in the old case in some things it's also parallel to the even case here we use the unified treatment but the story is not uh, by this one so in this things the even in the even case we can get some uh, results in the old case we also have the the corresponding results. Uh, up to now, the relationship between the even and the old, we have not any relation uh, up to now. So next, we construct the, the relationships between the even and the old case. So we introduce and recall the parity reverse representation. So in, in fact, it's very, uh, uh, very uh, uh, important property of the least variable and the representation theory. So at first, we gave the any uh, the, the vector superspace v zero plus v one. We use the the i s way is the is still the vector space obtained by its uh, interchange the even and old paths. That means SV for the uh, space SV, SV0 equals to V1, SV1 uh, equals to S0. So that means that we can construct a parity reverse map S from SV to SV. So this is called the, also called the suspensor operator. We usually use the uh, parity reverse map. Okay. So for any implementation of uh, the supraspectral, world, we can define a row X by a representation of the D algebral action on the S V. So row S defined by this one. So we can get a representation S V, the representation space is S V and, and the action is row S. So this is called the parity reverse of the V row. Okay, we can get, in fact, our main result. So in some things, we give the, the, uh, the duality between the old and the even orbiter. So give a new spectral, and the V is a representation. SV is a parity reverse. Then they exist a one-to-one -one correspondence between the old operator, the site of an operator and the, the site of an uh, even operator associated to the ISV. And uh, conversely, for the old operator, uh, for the even operator, they have the one-to-one -one correspondence between the site of the uh, even operator and the, the the, the old operator also to the SV. This correspondence between the O alpha and the o, uh, o alpha plus one with the SV, uh, the O alpha is the V, is SV, 
we we count the all orbital duality. So th this is the all orbital duality. This uh, uh, I think is quite a, a, a fundamental in the study of the, the in, in this study. In fact, we can give the uh, it really the uh, components give all orbital. We can define the Ts Ts from Sv to G by the Ts Su equals to Tu. So this is quite simple. And we find the Ts is uh, the, the, the S is all the map, so the Ts and the T with the, the, the Ts the degree is the T degree plus one. So the about the components is given by the T plus uh, two component to Ts. Okay, so by this, the orbital duality is naturally to us whether the duality between the even and the old operator in the above can be used to give a similar duality between the even and the old super R matrix in the new super algebra. If so, we can find uh, that means the old operator, uh, old super R matrix is not necessary to to study because we can get the, 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 the uh, duality. So from the study of the even case, we can get the old case, but the story is not, not so. So in fact, unfortunately, that is not true in the general. In fact, it, it gave a, a, a super R matrix, it's a pan super metric. Then the TR is, uh, com, uh, is in the, Orbiter authority to core representation. Then this is another orbiter, TRS. TRS is in the uh, parity, uh, parity reversion, uh, reverse, reverse parity of the core representation, AD star S. But the AD star S is usually not the core some core representation. So this is a problem. It's another remutation. So in this sense, the TRS cannot give a super R matrix. So that's the reason in the study of the super R matrix, the duality cannot obtain the, by this way. So our study is the orator in some things is extended. So we consider all operation, all representations in the study of the super R matrix is only for the operators in the, uh, in the one side is only cold wrong representation. But the cold wrong, uh, the, for the cold wrong representation, the uh, parity rewards, the, the, it's, your, it's not the cold wrong representation animal. So by the direct uh, representation between the, the, the super R matrix and the, the orbiter, we can not get the uh, parity, uh, get the duality of uh, the super R matrix. But we can consider the, the, for any orbiter, we can get uh, the big, uh, the, the, the duality for the, some of the different, uh, uh, usually different, uh, uh, these spreadables gave some the uh, another kind of the duality, the parity duality of the super R matrix. So combine the, the two together, we can get the the, the 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 following theorem. So first, the, this uh, by extend the 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 these three uh, equivalent conditions with the T and the T uh, T S the the the, the components. So we get the six the the uh, equivalent condition conditions. First, T is the orbiter in uh, authority to V, and we can get the T S is in the S V orbiter, but the parity is chain. Then from T we can get R T. In the this the uh, the super algebra is the super R matrix. We can also from the TS we can RTS. RTS is uh, uh, another is the in another the super algebra. So from the 
the DI, this writer with the uh, remutation of the row S star. And uh, uh, the parity is the T plus one, the BVT plus one. And from the RT, we can get the TRT. It's in the core representation in the, this the representation in this DI algebra. And we also can get the TRTS given by the RTS is the in this the super algebra with the core drum representation. Okay, so the first the uh, the equivalent between uh, one and two is just uh, the all operator duality, and uh, we can consider the the the, the equivalence. Uh, between three and four. So we can use the some notation. Give the 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 Lee super algebra is uh, the uh on the representation of the V and the homogeneous is the V uh, VI and the VI star is the uh, the dual basis. And we also can get the the SV, the dual vector subspace as the parity reverse vector subspace SV. And the SV is the image. We also can get the SVI and the SVI star is the space. Okay. Then we can rewrite the, the equivalent between the three and the four. Okay. Give a Lee I super. Some noise? Something with your microphone. Microphone. Okay. It's okay. 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 So give a uh, Lee super algebra and the representation. We gave uh, the, the T is a homogeneous linear map. We can get RT. It's by this one. It's a super R matrix with a degree T in the Lee super algebra. G rho star V star. If I know if RTS by this form is a super R matrix with degree T plus one in the least prior row G, uh, row S star, S V star. So here we didn't mention any uh, uh, anything involving the operator. We just gave the, directly gave the uh, correspondence between the two uh, uh, super R matrix, but uh, it's the, uh, in the different uh, least super algebra. So by this form, it's a, uh, uh, R matrix and another form is uh, uh, and, and uh, another is in the another least vector the the R uh, super matrix. Well, we can find both of the two two uh, R matrix uh, have the opposite the uh, parity. So we call it as the R matrix duality. Uh, similarly, we can give the components between the five and the six. Five and six is also another operator uh, in the scenes in the with the same not here with the same the representation is the different these uh, variables but uh, uh, the representation is uh, the same to call wrong representation and the one two, one the two is the same the these variable but uh, the different uh, uh, representation so this the uh, we call the, the Components between five and six is the, called the second operator duality. Okay, then that means from the O and the even operator, we can uh, uh, obtain a parity pair of operators and uh, a parity pair of the pan super symmetric super R matrix in different least variables and a pair of the operators associated to the core drawn representations of the least variables. We can use the, this uh, diagram to, to, to show the relation. In the ordinary case, we can use the T corresponding to RT and uh, corresponding to the TRT. Uh, and uh, in the least super case, we also can uh, in the, in the vertical uh, the correspondence is the just the generation of the other case uh, from the, the, the even and the old. So the from T R to R T to the R, uh, T R T and here and the, the, the right is T S 
RTS, TRTS. It's in the vertical case, it's the, the, the convergence keep the parities. But we use the horizontal convergence, it's changed the, the parity. We call the duality. They have the all operator duality. And in the case of the super R matrix, we have the R matrix duality. And in the uh, in the core ground representations, we have the second the operator duality. So this is the parity duality for operator and the super R matrix. Finally, in the we gave the the uh, the, the, the theory of the pre these superpositions to construct the operator and the super R matrix. First, uh, we we call the what is called a pre D superpositions. It's uh, the the associator is a super symmetry. So this call this just the, the super case of the pre D algebra by this one. Uh, as the same with the pretty algebra, we also have the two fundamental uh, properties of the pretty super algebra. First, uh, the, 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 the super uh, commentator is a uh, Lee super uh, algebra, is sub adjacent Lee uh, super sub algebra. And also, the left multiplication operators give, uh, the, the, uh, give the representation of the sub adjacent Lee super algebra. Okay. Then we can give the our uh, the representation uh, the the greedy superpositions under the O operator. So here we can give the uh, the 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 superpositions and the operator. We also can define uh, some structures on the representation space. We can define a product on the representation space, the representation super space. By this one, from this one we can see. The product satisfy the V alpha uh, V beta uh, 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 is in V alpha plus beta plus the degree uh, T. So we can find if T is even, so it's very uh, very simple. It's just the, the ordinary product. It's also satisfy the the degree uh, the uh, left symmetry uh, the grid form uh, the graded form. The, uh, the, the super left symmetry. So when T is even, we can define a pretty super algebra. And uh, T is old, so this is very important. If it's old, this is not, an, uh, it's not uh, the ordinary the product. It's called the old product. Old product is not the uh, V alpha, V beta, uh, product uh, V alpha and beta is in the V alpha plus V, uh, v alpha plus beta, so it but uh, must plus the one, so it's not the ordinary product. However, if in this case when it's all old, we can define S V. We cannot use the product in V, but in the S V, the parity, uh, the, the 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 reverse parity with space. So by this the S V. So in the SV, it's a pretty superpositive. Then we can get for representation of the least superpositive row, it's all the and the operator of G uh, and the TS is the, 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 the linear map, the compounding linear map, the pretty superpositive on the SV from the T and the TS are the same. So this means that from the no matter uh, old and even, from the, 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 the operator, we can get, for the even, we can get uh, the V. For the old, we can get uh, SV, okay? Then, uh, our re uh, the, the, another result is uh, give uh, 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 the, 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 the operator. When T is immutable, we can get a uh, uh, compatible the predict uh, spread group by this one. And uh, conversely, if for a pretty spider, the identity is an even operator, oh, sorry, to the AL. L is the uh, uh, regular representation constructed from the left multiplication of the uh, left, uh, uh, the pretty spider. And the identity S is an old operator, or oh, to the RS. This is important. So that means from the, the same, the Pretty super algebra. 
we can get identity and identity eyes, two orator. One is even orator and another is the old orator. Then we can get our main results from the 3D spectral. We can get R identity and R identity eyes. One even super matrix and one is old super matrix in the two semi direct product least spectral by this one. So that means from a pretty spectral, we can get two kind uh, two super matrix. One is even and one is old in this case. Uh, finally, we gave a uh, efficient, uh, we gave a concrete uh, example, gave uh, the one one dimensional least spectral with a homogeneous EF, and uh, the non zero product is by this one. And then we gave a remutation by this one. Okay, the remutation is also one one dimensional. And the T is uh, given by the TV. Uh, is uh, equal to f, and the tw is equal to e. This is invertible or old orator. Okay, then we can get uh, the old product. Well, we can also get uh, in the SV. We can get uh, the pretty super by this one, and uh, the ts is going by this one. It's an invertible the even orator of g according to the parity reverse limitation SV. It gives the same the pretty surprise uh, on three. And then we can get a, a compatible the pretty surprise from this one. And uh, this one is a uh, isomorphism of remutation of the, we found that the, 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 the remutation R and the RS is the isomorphic. Then the least surprise rule. Usually, the, 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 we construct the, the two D supervisor is the different, the same direct product. In, in our case, we found that the two D supervisors are isomorphic. In some sense, it's the same the D supervisor. So uh, the non-zero product is going to one. So we can get an uh, even skew symmetry, skew symmetry, uh, super symmetry, super matrix. And at the same, we can get the old, Super symmetry, uh, super symmetry, super matrix in the same the least spectral group. Not here, uh, we uh, both of the solutions from the same pretty super edge group. That's all. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much, Dr. Bai. So, any questions for speaker? No questions. So uh, thank you once more for thank interesting you. talk. I wish all of thank you. good luck. Thank you. Uh, so uh, we have now break for one and a half hour, yes? Oh, thank you. Uh, I, yes. I uh, after uh, after your wonderful talk, uh, I have a question. Um, uh -huh. okay. The the results in this paper uh, is based on the um Kirk's take of field is zero. Pardon, you you you, you ask me question or you right? Yeah. Mm. The characteristic of the field is based on uh, uh, the, the result in this paper yeah. mm, is based on uh, the characteristic of field. Uh, oh, uh, is okay. zero, zero. Yeah, oh, usually, oh, we, okay. we, in, in my talk, we, we assume the field is the character zero. So you 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 know for the for the uh, the superalgebra the superalgebra structure uh, study. The representations is related to the to, to the basic field. Uh, for the for the different for the character uh, uh, the uh, character non-zero p, usually the representation theory may be different. So uh, for our study, we we assumed to be the character zero. Thank you very much. 
uh, another question is, uh, what is the, what are the difference between router box operator and the O operator? The 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 router box operator is a special case. If in some things here we use the orbiter, uh, the the R matrix is the uh, orbiter associated to the core drum rotation. The rotor buster is the orbiter associated to the drum rotation. So this is just uh, uh, they are closely mm -hmm. related. You asked a very good question. <laughs> uh, thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> uh, a fam family question. Um, there are equations of Young um, equator. Uh, what is what are associated with uh, operator or O operator or rotor box operator? Pardon, I didn't know. Mm. Uh, uh, which operator mm. are associated with uh, the equation of the solutions of Young? Equations. So, uh, this equation, uh, sorry, Yang equation. You mean? <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, Yang 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 Bas Yang Bas Yes, 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 yes. yes. You mean the, the okay. relationship oh. between Yang Bas equation and the uh, and the Rotor Bas equation? Yeah. Yes. 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 Oh, yes. Oh, thank you so, very much. Oh, 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 so, okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, so from name is usually uh, confused uh, for 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 the persons which are not experts in the field. Usually the Young bar equation is from the the Young is uh, the the famous the uh, physicist Xian Yang, and the Baxter is uh, the Australian physicist Roger uh, R G Baxter. He's a physicist. And uh, uh, this uh, come uh, totally come from the study of the the, the quantum physics from uh, uh, in some things uh, okay it's a long story it's a more famous and uh, the the the, the rotor buster the rotor is uh, a, a mathematician in very uh, 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 excellent mathematician in the computers the buster is glenn buster it's not a physicist it's a mathematician it's a, a, a american mm. Uh, 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 it's a, a story. To, uh, it's an interesting story. Uh, uh, one of the uh, mathematicians in this field, uh, Fat, uh, Professor Fat, claimed about the ten about the ten more than ten years ago. He he he, he collected some of the materials about the, the stories about the two buster. He claimed to write a paper uh, with title. From Buster to Buster, but uh, actually up to now I have not uh, uh, found uh, he finished uh, this job. Okay, so thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, the two Buster is different. <laughs> mm, thank, you. thank you. More questions? No comments? No questions. <clears throat> thank you once more, Professor Bai. Thank you. So now uh, we have a break and start in time. <laughs>